Beer done with crafts and beer. So it's time for a wheelbarrow for your farmer, eh? Let's start by measure out and cut the wood beam for hands and wheels. Mark and cut out for the wheel. Keep that so warm and X sharp. If this is the first time with balsa wood and you're thinking about buying for your crafts, I recommend to buy a few different sizes right away. It will come to use. I rolled the planks to make them thinner, a matter of taste. Glue those beams and be precise, because small difference in small things can turn out big. I use wood glue to make the first rope sit and brush Mod Podge to glue the rest in place. Time to nail that bottom down. Cut out for the ropes. And cut for the grip. Use a divider to facilitate the wheel making. Don't cut out the wheel until you have cut out for the spokes. And also, a new sharp blade for this is a recommendation. Cut out a bit of sandpaper and fold it in the middle and sand very carefully to make the spokes somewhat straight and even. Time to X out the wheel. Sometimes the first try just don't cut it. So one keep at it till perfection. I'm using a strip from a watercolor paper with rough surface for the steel strip that protect the wood when using the wheelbarrow. I glue it on place with regular wood glue. Time to glue the stand on the barrel. Don't forget the support between them. Drill a hole in the wheel and use a steel wire. Glue it on place. Build the box. And don't you forget the support pins for the box, or it will break when you shovel it full 
with horse manure. Every farmer needs a shovel to the wheelbarrow. Take a steel wire, bend the end, cut out a bit of cardboard and glue it on place. Hide the joint with another piece of cardboard. Now take that shovel and wheelbarrow on with those Levi's. Grab a beer, get going Wrangler. And as always, bear down and craft.